Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after taking a break over the holiday season, Microsoft has released the first Windows 11 Insider Preview build, 26,220.7535, to the dev and beta channels. And this rolled out late on Friday last week in my region. And that's with the update KB5072046. So just a quick video and a quick overview as to what's new in the dev and beta channels. Now, first off, Microsoft says that Narrator can now work with Copilot on Windows 11 devices to generate detailed descriptions of images and visual elements. Apparently, you can trigger descriptions for a focused image or the entire screen with Copilot opening alongside Narrator to provide context-aware explanations and allow follow-up questions. And Microsoft says that on Copilot Plus PCs, on-device AI descriptions continue to work without sending data to the cloud. That's according to Microsoft. And Microsoft says that image sharing only occurs when you actually request a description. And just take note, this feature is not available in the European economic area in the dev and beta channels at this stage. And next up is that this new build introduces a new group policy option called Remove Microsoft Copilot App. So when enabled, it will allow admins and administrators to uninstall the Copilot App for users or devices under defined conditions, such as the app not being user installed or recently launched, according to Microsoft. And this policy is available on Enterprise, Pro and Education Editions. Just take note though that Copilot can still be reinstalled manually after removal, if you so wish. So I would consider those two changes and features to be the key highlights according to the change log. But Microsoft has rolled out some other changes and fixes. And if we head to the first, this build includes a little change to the Windows Spotlight desktop icon. This is how it currently looks in the stable version. And this is how it looks now in this latest Devon Beta Channel build, looking very similar to the Photos app icon. So that's a small refresh to the Windows Spotlight desktop icon. And then over and above that, guys, we get bug fixes for the Start menu, the File Explorer. There are printing dialog inconsistencies that have been fixed. Pen input flashes in Snippet Tool and Windows Update has received some fixes. And then because we are still in preview, we get the usual known issues because these are still early preview builds. But nonetheless, just a quick overview as to more or less what's new in the first Devon Beta Channel Insider Preview Build of this year, 2026. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.